Hello my beautiful Pisces, welcome to my channel. This is your favorite fortune teller, Divine Light. Today I'm going to do a coffee cup reading for the week and due to the general nature of this reading, please take what resonates with you and leave what doesn't for the others. If you're enjoying these videos, don't forget to give them a thumbs up and if you want to see more of these, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. We're going to the 30,000 this month, so if you haven't already subscribed it's free and you can unsubscribe anytime you want but it helps the channel a lot and helps to spread the energies all right guys i'm gonna start with an oracle card and let's see what the general energy is for you this is the deck of the priestess of light oracle from sandra and taylor and kimberly weber i'm using a licensed turkish version but you can go ahead and um find them on anywhere you want and online probably okay let's see what the general energies are for my beautiful pisces for the week what do you need to know okay uh the league of blessings okay get rid of um, limitations getting rid of limitations and this is the number 47 you can see the leopard energy behind her so there is going to be you can see the light that she's forming so uh i said she but this is genderless so you can take it however it resonates with you there is going to be a moment this week that you're gonna actually just free yourself from all kinds of limitations which will help you um manifest this energy of abundance into your life okay that's how i feel the message is resonating and i'm gonna get into your cup now and let us see what is actually going to be happening okay i see a crowded cup on the bottom of the cup there is a crescent moon also like a full moon you can see the crescent moon when i turn around like that there is a crescent moon right there and overall, there's a full moon. Full moon, the ring usually indicates commitment, marriage. If you are looking for marriage, looking for commitment, somebody is actually going to be coming towards you with an offer or maybe you're going to be deciding that. This can also be commitment to a job, to a place. Maybe you're going to pack up and move to a new place because there is a path opening up for you. And this looks like actually a fish head. I think one of the readings had the fish head person, maybe Aquarius. Um, so fish, you are a fish, you're the Pisces. Also, they indicate fishes are symbols of money, wealth, and abundance in this kind of readings. So um, there is going to be a rush of um, abundance coming into your life. And there is a white paper showing here. There is a legal matter. If you're going through a legal thing, that is going to be resolving. And there is also another ring right there. You can see the ring clearly. So definitely a commitment showing up for you. Like I said, this doesn't have to be a romantic thing. If you're not looking for a romance, can be someone that is actually um going to be committing themselves to you or uh like um can be a new job and i see a letter e and v let me tell n m maybe emily or like um someone's in their first name or the last name this words can be or the place and um i'm gonna tell you another thing okay i see e and M, also this looks like E and V to me. So this actually means home, house, home. They mean the same thing, that the word in my language. So if any of you planning to move and buy a house and become a homeowner, there is also a roof showing here. So following this week, you're going to start manifesting this. Okay, you're attracting the right people in the right places. Maybe like there's actually another roof here. Maybe you're changing in place, your place um, or finding the right spot to move in can be like an ideal best place for you, your environment. Maybe if you have a pet, you're going to find somewhere that is very compatible for your pet to, you know, um, enjoy themselves but i feel like there's something home related house related is going to be happening this week for you like i said the legal paper there's another legal paper here so it can be a new lease yeah it can be a contract 
also like i said there's a big crowd here these people can be like also if you're running your own business your customers showing up okay because um the best way to make money is actually give a service or sell something to the people because um like when you have a product and you sell it for um a certain amount to a certain amount of people then you have the chunk of money that you want okay so i'm not going to give you the math but you can just google it and find the math for when it comes to making money and i feel like this week throughout the week you're gonna have a lot of interactions with different people and there are some things happening here that just you put some roots down you see like you planted the seed and the seed is not showing it because it's growing roots down because there are some things there are some plants actually when you plant them you don't see the the ground the earth is moving for a very long time because the roots grow deeper faster than the top of the tree so maybe there is something that you have planted in the past or you're gonna get an opportunity something that seems like grows so slowly but it will become huge massive very soon and towards the weekend you are actually planting the seeds of this thing and there is a male figure here he's just sitting on a throne so this looks like someone with authority and power this person is also supporting your endeavors they're gonna give you support when you're doing this this can be like a family member a brother or a boss or someone that you're going to be taking the, the support the money financial support from but this person is just standing right here and supporting you with the things that you're doing okay towards the end of the week i see a path opening and there's a crowded path and something tells me you're going to go visit some people to get information so you're going to be informed during the towards the weekend you're going to get information and so, and then there's another legal paper maybe you're going to sign up to a course or start getting something from these people and sign up uh, an agreement with them some sort of like a legal thing showing up towards the weekend for you guys all right, now I'm going to get into your plate. If you have a question, a desire, an intention, just hold it in your mind. And let's see what the answer is going to be for you. Okay, the full moon, double full moon. There's another full moon right here. There's the double ring right here for you. Definitely, I see commitment. Maybe you're not looking for love. It can be a surprise a thing showing up for you. Surprise commitment. And both of the rings have beautiful energies, okay? So um but like i said you can take it how it resonates what kind of commitment do you want maybe you want the commitment not of a person of like a maybe institution and your desire is actually going to take some time however whatever this is this reminds me of this world card from tarot just coming full circle the things a cycle is going to be completing in your life with that and i see someone here she looks like she's a nun or someone with a very long hair and she breaks the ring this ring can also be interpreted as a chain maybe you are a part of this thing this uh, chain that is um you know just making you shrink into a smaller piece but when you're breaking this chain maybe you're just gonna establish your own thing start something new for yourself and um you can see when you break the chain the chain turns into this big fishes coming your way the fishes symbolize money and wealth so this will end up being very fruitful for you i also see an arrow here arrows symbolize sagittarius also um warrior spirit okay so whatever this is you're gonna find this masculine energy this taking action and doing things getting things done and you're gonna start manifesting this warrior energy in your life when you break the ring okay when you get out of the grind when you start seeing the things in as what they are okay and when this thing is actually coming down as a snake also that represents fire energy in tarot that also represents the kundalini energy and the creation energy that we all have in our body so i feel like like throughout this week you're going to experience a lot of moments of this creation manifestation and energy flowing through your body and maybe attracting the right people to the right place in the right time that you're going to have a lot of like coincidence like but actually intentional your the created by your intention kind of moments throughout the week all right my beautifuls that's all for today hope you enjoy your reading if you do don't forget to give the thumbs up and if you want to see more of these go ahead and subscribe to my channel and become a part of this beautiful soul community 
I wish you all a magical week. Have fun and enjoy yourselves. Bye.